Hey guys, today I want to show you a really quick and easy way to make chai tea latte, I guess you can call it. This is perfect for the weather right now because if you're like me, you don't want to drive all the way down to Starbucks or McDonald's to grab a hot drink. So here's what you guys will be needing for this really quick recipe. First of all, you're going to need a cup and you're going to need water. I just put a cup of water in this measuring cup and you're also going to need your favorite kind of tea. Um, I have chai green tea and I also have this one. It's a brand called Tea India and it's ginger chai tea. And I'm gonna be using this one, but you can use any kind of tea that you want. You can also mix two different types of tea, which is something I like to do sometimes too. Um, the next thing you're gonna need is sugar. That's optional and whipped cream is optional also and you're going to need milk. So. Let's get started. The first thing you want to do is fill your cup with the water. Don't fill it all the way up. Make sure you leave a little bit of space in your cup because you are going to put milk in there. The next thing you want to do is put your cup in the microwave and you want to microwave that for two minutes. After two minutes, you want to take your cup out of the microwave and now it will be hot, so be careful. Next, you're going to be taking your favorite tea bags, take two of them and put them into your water and have them steep for about a minute or two. And when I'm in a rush or I have no patience, I just like to help that steep in there a little more. The darker your tea becomes, the better. While your water is still hot, go ahead and add your sugar. I added three spoons. I know for some people that's a lot, but that's what I like to drink. So after I've added my sugar, I'm going to make sure that's stirred all the way in there. By now it's been two minutes, and so my tea has turned a very dark color. And by now I can smell the ginger really strong because it is ginger tea that I make. I'm making ginger chai tea so I can smell the ginger really strong. And I wanted to make ginger chai tea because um, my throat is a little bit sore and ginger is really good for that. So I just wanted something to soothe my throat. And the next thing you want to do is add your milk. Now this is up to you how much milk you want. I'm just going to be putting about that much, about to the top of the cup, and stir that in. And the more you stir it, the darker it's going to become. Make sure you take your tea bags out of your tea because you don't want to have that bothering you when you are drinking this. And the last step, which is optional, is of course whipped cream and there you have it. my ginger chai tea is all ready for me to drink and this is how I make my chai tea when I am too lazy to go out to buy something or I really don't want to spend the money when I can make it at home and it's easy it's simple and I hope you guys enjoyed and if you guys tried this make sure you let me know how it turned out and I will talk to you guys in my next video thank you for watching bye